June 1st marked the beginning of the 2011 hurricane season and experts have predicted a higher than average season indicating that there is a higher than average probability for a major event in the Caribbean this year. According to the Department of Disaster Management, the 2011 hurricane season is predicted to be more active than the average for the 1950 to 2000 seasons with approximately 17 named storms, 9 hurricanes and 5 major hurricanes. Governor Boyd McClary in his message to the territory says every home and every business need a plan and to be prepared for the hurricane season. We cannot predict which storm might impact the Virgin Islands, but the experts are predicting a busy hurricane season in the Atlantic Basin with about 17 named storms including five major ones. So whatever your circumstances, every home and every business needs to have a plan to protect itself during an emergency. Prepare a disaster kit and know where to go if evacuation is necessary. Your plan should contain information to help you and your family in both weather-related and other emergencies. It's also important that you don't forget your pets. One reason many people stay behind when they should go is a fear of leaving their animals. Additionally, safeguarding important documents such as your ID, your social security card, insurance documents and policies and emergency contact information is essential to easing any disruption that may occur during a disaster. The governor said careful preparations can make a huge difference and everyone should help make their communities more resilient to hazards and disaster. He asked residents to help those persons who are vulnerable and may need assistance when preparing for a disaster. The Virgin Islands is home to a significant number of senior citizens and approximately one in four of them suffers from some physical impairment. Make sure to have a list and a generous supply of all medications and a plan for refilling prescriptions as needed. It's critical that as good neighbors, we assist those who are vulnerable and who might not be able to prepare as well as we can for a disaster. In any emergency, we must come together as Virgin Islanders to ensure that no person is left without help. According to NOAA, the 2011 outlook reflects an expected set of conditions that is conducive to above normal Atlantic hurricane activity. These conditions are based on three climate factors. The expected continuation of the tropical multi-decadal signal, a continuation of above average sea surface temperatures in the tropical Atlantic Ocean and Caribbean Sea, and ENSO, the neutral conditions, most likely no El Nino or La Nina. Last year, heavy rainfall in the Virgin Islands resulted in widespread damages to businesses, homes, roads and other infrastructure during the hurricane season. Hurricane Earl, a Category 3 hurricane, also impacted the BVI last August. 